We here at Skillcapped have scoured the streams of the best Mythic Plus players from Echo and Method and discovered one common thing. Incredible weak aura packages that provide them with information you might be missing out on during your runs. Don't ask how, but we managed to borrow a few of these packages ourselves. And today, we'll be sharing the goods with you. So stay tuned, because we will be telling you exactly what weak auras you need for every class, dungeon, and affix, combined with some quality of life auras that make your life easier in Mythic Plus. Speaking of which, if you are the type of player who wants to rank up fast this season, we're proud to announce that we've been developing brand new Mythic Plus guides for Season 3, which can only be found at SkillCap.com. For over a decade, we've been teaching competitive WoW to an audience of over half a million lifetime users, helping players just like you achieve their goals and make real progress. We do this by choosing to work with the best players from guilds like Echo and Method, who help us produce class courses with tips and tricks that the cutting edge players use to push the highest keys. In fact, we're so confident our service works that we even offer a rating gain guarantee, where we promise that by using our courses, you will gain at least 500 Mythic Plus rating. We currently have guides available for the classes you see on screen, and in the following weeks, we'll be adding more. So even if your spec isn't available now, be sure to check back later and join our Discord where you can join a growing community of passionate players, enjoying premium perks like our Asker Pro Forum, and even a new giveaway channel where you can win some sweet loot. Check the links below to get started on your journey today with an exclusive discount offer. Let's start by breaking down class weak aura packages. Chances are you are using one of these by now, but every spec has tons of weak auras available to display their abilities in a more concise and easy to read manner. The two biggest class weak aura creators are Luckthos and Afnar. Both offer packages for every class that are unbelievably useful. These will display all your abilities in the center of your screen, meaning you spend more time watching the fire at your feet and less time looking all over your monitor to see if a niche ability is off cooldown, just to inevitably catch a case of the deads from a stray frontal. Weak auras will typically be found on wago.io, but can also be shared in game. There's a huge selection, so if you don't like the suggested auras in this video, head on over to the website to find alternatives. Let's look at a clip of a weak aura package in action. In this clip, you're going to see a player reacting to procs while also dodging floor effects, all while never having to truly move their eyes across the screen, since all of their core rotational abilities, procs, and cooldowns are all contained in a convenient place on the screen. If you want to track other class-specific buffs or cooldowns, it's relatively straightforward to make your own weak aura. Just click New Aura, and then Icon under Advanced. Then in the Trigger tab, select Name, and then type the buff you want to track. In this case, let's do our Weapon Enchant. If you want to be precise, you can also use the Spell ID of any buff, which can either be found on Wowhead, or by using the ID Tip add-on, which adds Spell IDs to tooltips, including your buffs. Then you can modify some simple settings, including some display options. And in the Actions tab, you can check Play Sound to have audio cue whenever the buff is active. For more complicated spell tracking, we highly suggest simply using Google to search what you want, like an efflorescence tracker for druids. One final thing to consider is streamers or content creators can also have their own packages. These are often available to supporters via subscribing or supporting in other ways. If you see a creator with a UI you like, check to see if it's available to supporters. Next up is Dungeon Packages, weak auras that are designed to provide you information as you progress through a key. Miraz from Echo just updated his spell CD tracker for Season 3, which is a replacement for other spell trackers from earlier this expansion, like Relo's Dungeon Auras. Miraz's spell CD's weak auras include ability trackers for every mob, which is particularly useful on Trash where there is a lot going on. The spell CD's help you keep track of when an ability is about to happen, which enables you to be proactive and plan ahead with interrupts, stops, or defensive CD's. The impact that these weak auras have is truly remarkable. The difference between having them and not having them is akin to having the ability to see into the future. Every ability that poses a risk to your party is highlighted with timers, ensuring that you can adjust your position and stay alive. Now, there are plenty of situations where this add-on is useful, but let's see it in action in Atal Dazar. Where these Confessor mobs cast Bwamsamdi's Mantle, a crucial spell to interrupt with one big problem, it has a relatively fast cast time. So instead of being off guard when this cast happens, you can see the spell's CD next to the nameplate, which allows you to hold your kicks or CC for when it's cast, instantly enabling you to stop it. This is also incredibly useful for non-interruptible casts, like Etch from the Heart's Bane Runeweaver in Waycrest Manor. 
Even though this cast cannot be stopped, tracking the cooldowns allows you to be ready to use a defensive on demand if you're targeted. This is definitely one of the most functional weak aura packages you can download, and we highly recommend it for any player looking to push high keys. Additionally, we would suggest having a separate aura to alert you of any mechanics that are currently affecting your character. This works hand in hand with Mira's weak auras. Not only will you be able to see what mechanics are coming up, but with M plus super dungeons, you can react to any mechanics currently active on you. Which means you get the best of both worlds, knowing what you will need to react to in the future and knowing what to react to immediately. Now that we've made dungeons easier to handle with some dungeon weak auras, let's discuss affixes. Affixes can be troublesome if you're unprepared for them. And the introduction of Incorporeal and Afflicted has made them more relevant than ever as they demand specific control. Fortunately, once again, the developers of Weak Auras have come to our rescue. Lucky One UI, a talented developer, has assembled a comprehensive package that tracks every affix and even predicts affixes that operate on a timer, such as Incorporeal, Afflicted, and Entangling. In addition, this package will also provide information on crucial aspects, such as Standing and Sanguine, the number of bursting stacks you have, the ability to sue the raging mob, and detailed guidance on handling the timer-based affixes mentioned earlier. For instance, it will notify you when to dispel Afflicted or when to interrupt Incorporeal. Let's once again observe one of these weak auras in action, focusing on Incorporeal this time. In the following clip, you'll notice a prominent cast bar appearing, instructing the player to apply crowd control on the mob before it casts a detrimental ability that heavily debuffs the party. Additionally, it is possible to attach a sound to these weak auras, providing an audio cue when the aura triggers and alerts you to the presence of the targeted mob. The final category of weak auras we have obtained includes more general and useful auras designed to enhance your overall experience in Mythic Plus. Firstly, let's discuss an auto marker. Megawatt offers arguably the most comprehensive version of this aura. The purpose of an auto marker is to assign consistent marks to specific mobs that are pre-programmed by the weak aura to be deemed as dangerous every time you enter combat with any pack. This allows you to pre-assign kicks and have a clearer understanding of which mobs to target with crowd control abilities. It greatly facilitates communication during a run and significantly reduces the number of wasted kicks, making it an incredibly useful tool for optimizing group coordination. In organized groups, it's quite common for tanks to assign markers using a keybind to mark mobs on pull, with assignments sometimes changing from pull to pull. In pugs, it's more common to get a single marker assigned at the start of the run and then stick with it the entire dungeon. Now let's observe an auto marker in action. In this clip, you'll witness that as soon as the team engages in combat, all the casters are instantly marked. The players would have pre-assigned kicks, which means each member will know which mob they need to control. This allows them to concentrate more on survival and their rotation, freeing up mental capacity for other crucial aspects of the encounter. Moving on, we have a key timer replacement weak aura, and here, Relo takes the lead in this category. This remarkable weak aura provides a newer and more detailed version of the Mythic Plus timer. It tracks the time it takes to defeat each boss, and it offers real-time information on not only the amount of trash you have cleared, but also how much your current pull contributes to the overall percentage. On the surface level, this feature enables you to precisely manage your progress at the end of the dungeon, ensuring that you have enough percentage without falling short or exceeding the timer. A more advanced use of this weak aura is to help with split timings. Since the add-on compares your current progress to your best split, you can instantly know how far ahead or behind you are for the entire dungeon. And if you are behind, it then means you might need to pull bigger or change your lust timings to accommodate. Definitely very useful, even though this timer seems relatively simple. Finally, if you are looking for a weak aura to track kicks and cooldowns for your team, you might get more value from Omni CD, which can do both of these things. This is a crucial add-on for every role when set up properly. Knowing your party's kicks and cooldowns is vital for making better decisions, and it's no wonder that almost every high-rated player considers this one of the most fundamental add-ons. If you want a full breakdown of this add-on and how to set it up for every class, let us know in the comments below. Before we wrap up, it's important to note that almost all of these weak auras have alternative options that are equally effective. If you come across one that doesn't work for you, be sure to search for a suitable replacement. Additionally, it is crucial to support your favorite creators. If you come across a UI that you love, visit the creator's streams and see if they have a package available. Many creators have comprehensive collections of these weak auras and more, customized to their own preferences, which you can benefit from. Anyway, by combining all these weak auras, you are positioning yourself for success in your journey to improve your Mythic Plus rating. And if you want some help along the way, be sure to visit skillcap.com using the link below. We've been working with cutting edge players from Echo and Method to make some amazing courses available on our brand new Mythic Plus site. Here, you can learn the hidden secrets of your class as you discover tricks used by top players that allow you to maximize your DPS, healing, and survivability, while also learning some cool tips on how to use your utility, just like MDI and TGB caliber players. Right now, we are building courses for everyone, so if your class isn't represented today, be sure to check back later, where we plan to have most specs fully ready by the holidays. 
We're so confident our website works that we even offer a rating gain guarantee if you don't add at least 500 points to your IO score while using our guides. So what are you waiting for? Visit the links below to get started. As always though, we want to thank you all for watching. See you soon.